Hey friends, I hope you're excited for today because we're going to be building a project together uh, using electricity. And uh, it's an LED flashlight. You'll be getting a baggie today. You'll need this baggie. You'll probably need a pair of scissors to cut through some electrical tape. You'll probably get a, a roll of colored electrical tape. I'm just going to use some masking tape. That works just fine too. And uh, we're going to build our own working flashlight. And because it's electric circuit that we're building, we know that we have to have that complete loop. We know that the electricity, like this roll of tape here, has to have a starting point with a battery source and then an output like our light bulb, but it also has to be connected in a loop. And our materials that we have to use, yeah, that's right, have to be conductors and made out of what material? Yep, metal. So if you're ready to get started, we're gonna pause the video in between each scene and um, don't worry, throughout the day today, your project might not work. And that's okay. You're gonna need to use your problem solving skills and work through the process to build this and test it out. Just like we've been working on the design process with our fairy tale engineering. You need to do that now for our final second grade project. This is it. This is your final discovery project and it's a super fun one. All right, so use that perseverance and let's get started. Baggy, we have several different materials. We have our battery, which is our power source. We'll put that to the side for now. We're going to need copper tape. This is metal tape, and it's going to act as one of our conductors. You'll have two pieces of that. You'll have a tongue depressor or popsicle stick. Our battery clip, which is a paper clip, also metal, good conductor. And you should have one LED light bulb that has two rods coming off of it. That's going to be super important to complete your circuit. To get started with you making it, you'll need a small piece of tape and you can just set that to the side for now. We'll come back to that piece of tape in just a little bit. We're going to take now the copper tape and put that on either side of our popsicle stick and when we build that you'll see that it should fit nicely right on there but we don't want it to go off the edges you do not want it wrapping around the sides otherwise it will not light up your light bulb and to get started I just peel off a little bit of the back here and I'm going to take that And I'm going to lay that down and slowly press and follow with my finger right in the center, getting that piece of copper tape on there. Now, if it does happen to go down towards the edge and start to overlap, you can just tear that piece off. That's it. There it is, nice and clean. Uh, and you know what's really cool? You can go home and say, Mom, Dad, I'm so strong, I can rip metal. <laughs> because that's what this copper tape is. And we're gonna do the same thing to the other side. There we go. Next thing is to take, now that we have the copper tape on both sides and that we have space up top, we're gonna to take this light bulb and we're going to fasten that to our flashlight. Now, you notice that we have two prongs here on our light bulb. We're gonna take that either prong and make sure that it's touching both sides of our popsicle stick and the copper tape. So I just slide that on. So if you can see here, I just took those two prongs and I fit that together like so. Now, we'll check one side. I've got the metal touching the copper tape right by my finger there. That's exactly what you want. And on the other side as well. Now I'm going to take that tape and I'm going to tape that right on there so that my flashlight rod doesn't move on that side. And I'm gonna wrap it around and I'm gonna do the same thing to the other side. Just 
want that rod touching it. If you have two rods touching the same side, that's not a complete circuit. So what will happen is the electricity will flow up one side, touch that middle rod, and come around to our other side and back down. But how does it complete the loop and go back over to the other side? Well, now it's time for that battery. So let's take that battery out. And that battery gets placed on there, but it doesn't light up the light bulb. We still need our paper clip. And for this to work, that battery could be on the right side. How do I know it's on the right side? Well, when I clip it on there and it's nice and firm, my light bulb should light up if it's all connected right. If it's not, I'm gonna flip this over and I'm gonna put the battery on the other side. Which side of my battery goes up? Well, if you look at your battery, there's a little shiny plus sign. The other side is the rough side. That rough side is gonna to touch your popsicle stick. And let's try it out here. And it worked. There we go, I happen to have it on the right side. You'll notice it goes off, but it's still clipped on. That's because I'm holding it down with my hand for a firm connection and making sure that everything is touching. Now, what happens if it wasn't lighting up? You put the rough side down on your popsicle stick. You check to make sure that none of the copper tape is overlapping, and that's gonna make a short circuit if you do, so you don't want that. And you made sure that your rods were taped on there and the one rod was touching the copper tape on one side, one rod is touching the copper tape on the other. And you go and you clip that battery on there and it's like, it's not, it's not working. Well, you've checked everything else. Take that battery, like I said, flip that popsicle stick over and try it on the other side. There it is, it's lighting up. Hold it on there. And make it work sometimes your battery your flashlight might work and you don't have to hold it on there that's great to get it stop working that's right just can disconnect the battery and the paper clip from your flashlight you'll be able to take this home in your baggie today and take home your working flashlight but before you finish and put it away put that battery back on that flashlight open up book creator make a book creator video and show off how you made a working flashlight. Have fun today, friends, and everything you got today, you get to go take home inside that baggie. I hope that you have fun with your LED flashlights. Bye, everybody.